I was just sent this indoor LED hydroponic growing set to review from Gree Health. I've never used something like this before, but I'm really excited. So let's do this together. We're gonna unbox it, assemble it, and see if we can get some seeds to grow. Everything is included that you need here except for your seeds, so you do have to get those separately. I will link both of these below. Here we go, this is it, nice and compact. Controls are on the top. We've got power, veg, flower, and pump. Here are your LED lights. Here is your hydroponic container. Take off all the tape, let's look at this. It does come with an instruction guide, so if you're newbie like me, no worries, it's gonna tell you exactly how to set it up and grow your flowers or veggies or fruits or herbs or whatever without soil. Here are the little sponges. So that's what's gonna hold your seeds and absorb the water in these together. You've got plant food, support rods. This is gonna be the arm that holds the lights up. Your power cord, your water pump that's got little suctions on it. This is also gonna be part of the pump and this down here. You've got a little window to show your water level in there. First, we're gonna insert the arm into the light. You'll see there's a USB plug that's gonna connect. The arrow is pointing up. So we're in and then that's how it's gonna extend. You just push in here to adjust back up. This is just gonna go right in here. This is the shortest setting. It's about a foot between there. That is the highest setting, like maybe two and a half feet. I mean, that's like really tall. We're gonna go back down. Suggest soaking the seeds for an hour before starting to grow them. So we're gonna do that. We're starting with basil. Next we'll do oregano. Last but not least, we have thyme. We're going to install the pump right in here. Plug in to this pump port here on the back. Our power cord is the other one back here. Then this cover pops on right here. This is gonna stay over here as you pop this on. Perfection. Let's plug it in. Push power. And there's the lights. Look at them. Wow, so bright. Then you can change the setting. Veg, flower, pump, off. The veg mode uses the red, blue, and white LEDs, having them on for 16 hours and off for eight automatic, and it repeats the cycle every day. The flower mode uses the red and white LEDs, also with a cycle of 16 hours on, eight hours off. You can turn the pump on or off. If it's on, it's gonna cycle 30 minutes on, 30 minutes off around the clock. So easy to use and just turn it on and it just takes care of it for you. It comes with these two bottles of dried plant food, fill them with water and shake to fully dissolve. You're gonna measure out and dilute them into basically five milliliters each per one liter of water and that is what's gonna go in here. Keep using these to refill the water as needed. So that's one liter showing up there. So this is gonna hold about three liters. So we're gonna do that two more times. I'm gonna put this back on. If you already have your plants in there and you're just refilling the water, you're not gonna take this off, obviously. You're just gonna fill it right here. Now we're ready to plant. We're gonna take one of these. They are plastic. And we're gonna take one of these sponges. It really could not be easier. There's a hole in the middle. Your seeds are gonna go in there. This goes in here, like so. Put two to three seeds in here. Now, the tricky part is that if you were soaking them like I am, then it's really hard to, they're just sticking to my fingers. So I'm gonna use a toothpick. I'm gonna put them in here into the hole. First one is ready. Just plop it in there. You want them down in the hole, not sitting on top. Next, we're gonna put on these little plastic seedling caps until they have germinated. Turn it on. Let's go. You can hear the pump just barely. It's really quiet. There are the lights. If you have a reflective surface here, they will reflect. They're just LED, not UV or anything like that. Not feeling any warmth, just light. We're on day four and we are just starting to see the first start of germination on a few. Very exciting. Look at that, here they come. Here we are, one week update. They are looking good. Look at these guys. So 
impressed with how they're growing. Oh my goodness. Our water hasn't really come down at all. So we're gonna keep letting them grow. Here we are, day 20 after planting. Most of them are looking great. This one has died. He kind of detached and dried up, probably due to the seed itself being no good. This one also looks to be having some trouble, but the rest are doing really, really nicely. Super impressed. It's very quiet. It's a cute little planter, fun to try and use. This is our water level. It's after 20 days. A great hydroponic system. Give it a try.